Okay, so since the Derringer 28 from Original Skateboards is discontinued until next year, um, I decided to take matters into my own hands. You know what they say, if you want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. So, here's my Derringer. Um, it's about, well, maybe like five plies, five ply. Um, not sure what it is, but it's really, it's pretty strong. Um, hold on. I already made one board. It's right here drying. Since it's just about to get Christmas time, um, I use Christmas colors. Skate great SG. Right there. Here's my piece of shit 2x4 cruiser I was using. Um, it's about 20 plies. Can't see. It's like an inch thick. It sucks. It worked for the time being, but... This is my brother's board. I think it's gonna snap, but... So... I decided to make my own Derringer. Um, I'm gonna give it, I'm gonna drill some holes, just make sure the trucks and stuff fit in fine, they're nice and aligned, and then I'll paint it and, uh, urethane it, and it should look pretty good. Peace. Okay, so I put the trucks on, just to see if they fit, and they look pretty good. Um, I put two risers on, both eighth of an inch, so it's a quarter of an inch rise on the board, just to make it a little funner on the carves. Now... The wood feels really um, quite strong on the longer board, so in this board it feels even quite a bit stronger, so moment of truth. Will it snap under my 165 pound 6 foot frame? Let's see how much flex we got on it. So put that down very carefully right there. Okay, so... too much, but considering I'm 165 pounds, that's pretty good. So, um, yeah. I'll get that painted and urethaned. Okay, so here's the darn I got it all urethaned and painted, and I'm um, just letting it dry. And then um, at some point I'll try to put some grip tape on. And, uh, yeah. Okay. So if you're gonna attempt what I just did, just um, here are a few pointers. Um, one, you're gonna mess up a few times on your first few boards, so make sure you practice a few times. Get wood that is cheap but strong, so that when you if you break your board, then you can buy new wood and try again. Um, what else? Uh, Make sure, I already said it, but make sure you buy strong wood so that your board won't snap. Um, you can either do solid wood, like this board right here. This is my brother's board. It's not a bad little cruiser. It's a little thick, but whatever. Or if you're going to layer it, use strong glue. I suggest, like, um... Elmer's glue or tight bond. Those are two of the best ones you can use. Uh, I think that's basically it. Um, oh, be creative. Um, just go nuts. You can either have something as simple as the Derringer, or go with something like a really wide freestyle board. So, there you go.